Hi everyone. In this video, I will explain how to do the mean deflection of beam using moment area method. For this cantilever beam, there is a 20 kN meter moment applied at the end of the beam. The problem is to determine the maximum and deflection at the beam. Okay, first of all, we need to draw M over EI diagram. So based on the beam, okay, we draw Y X as this is X and then Y as this is M over EI and we have a 20 kN of moment. So of course at B also have 20 kN moment. So therefore the diagram is look like this. Okay, so you have 20 kilo newton meter, right? So it's negative sign so in here. Then we draw elastic curve at the beam. So in the cantilever beam, we know that for fixed support, deflection equal to zero, slope equal to zero. So we draw the elastic curve is like this. Now, we can proceed to define the maximum slope and deflection. As you can see from the figure here, we know that the maximum slope and deflection is at the end of the cantilever beam. So, at in here. So, we need to find the slope based on two tangent. Okay. So, let's say we draw the tangent line here. So this will be tangent A, I call as a tangent A. And then you will have the reference tangent based on here. So this I call as reference tangent. Okay, so you have a two tangent here, tangent reference and tangent A. Therefore, we can see between these two tangent, there will be angle of A or you can see in here is the same as the tangent here so you have a tangent A. Applying theorem number one, the slope at the free end A equal to the area of the M over EI diagram between A and B. So therefore we apply the children number one. We know that A, B, M over E, I, D, X, which is this is the area under the graph. Therefore, is you have the 20 times with the 6 meter over EI. Okay. So, therefore, you will get negative. Okay. For a moment, is negative. Negative 100 over EI. Okay. So, this is the value of theta A. Next, we need to define the maximum deflection. So, we draw the tangent deviation, right, at the end of cantilever at point A. So, this will be delta A, right? Based on here, you have a two tangent. Of course, this is a reference of the tangent. Therefore, for deflection of the beam is okay, deflection okay, delta A is x bar okay, A, B, M over E, I, D, X which is area under the graph of from point A to B Okay, we're using a children number two. Okay, your 
area is the same as the slope 20 times C over EI. Okay, for X bar here, sin is rectangular. So, we know that this is sin. So, is half of that. Therefore, your X bar 6 divided by 2, you will get negative 360 over EI. So, it's going down. Okay. Alright, that's all for now. Thank you for watching.